news, and it's time for the top five. Brought to you by Layfeld Welding and Industrial Supply. At number five, Coldwater, Zach McKibben, the senior, channeling his inner beast mode, hits that circle button and spins his way into the end zone. At number four, we head to Versailles, the beauty that is whole field. Marion Local taking a deep shot towards the end zone, and the Tigers' Jacob Carmen turns into Tyron Matthew with a pick in the end zone. The Tigers would fall in overtime to the Flyers. At number three, it's Elida's Nick Nebel. Taking back quarterback Landon Flea Hardy's pass 45 yards the other way. Pick six as Elida rings the victory bell for the second straight week. 27 to seven over their rivals to the east. More on Nebel and the Bulldogs coming up in just a couple of minutes. At number two, it's girls soccer action. Jade Bailey of Liberty Benton from about 25 yards out. She gives the Eagles a 2-1 lead in their soccer contest last Saturday at Shawnee. And at number one, we stay with Liberty Benton. Carson Parker's pass is deflected by Bryson Abbott off of the foot of Quintel Peoples and into the midst of Moses Romero. They'll take it back to the 20 yard line and the Eagles win the bird watching battle over LCC at Lima Stadium Park last Saturday night. And that is your Layfeld Welding and Industrial Supplies top five right here on the Sports Report.